So, good morning. Um, I am, as you can see, this is this is how jury rigged I had to make. I kid you not. This, uh, everybody who's either a recorder or, or I'm sorry, a creator or a gamer is screaming at me with or has tuned out by now because they're just like, no, you do not do this. You do not do that to the equipment. Electronics do not get treated this poorly. And that's right. That's true. That's that's correct. You should not do this. This is a this is cheap bad behavior. But I just wanted to set everything up. So, um, the trichafta has been analyzed, and my liver is not happy with it. It does not prevent hospitalizations, <laughs> like like this one, from happening. It can't stop them. Um, I did get a really nice view, though. It's kind of cool. You can't really see it. Oh, this is a nice webcam. Holy shit. Oh. Yeah, so I have a nice room, honestly. I really do. And I even have a bike, which I'm standing next to. A stationary bike. Can you believe that stuff? That's great. I think that's awesome. So, um, I pointed just this way for no other reason. Actually, I should keep that on. I should definitely keep that I should, I should definitely keep that on. Um, I pointed us this way because natural light, you can actually see my face instead of uh, having to tune the, the brightness and etc. Anyway, I wanted to say mainly hello. And also... Um, talk about, hey, I made it back into the hospital without a hitch. Like, usually there's something, something in the hospital goes wrong in the first three days. I, I came in two days ago. Yeah, two days ago. Um, did it right? Right? Is today Sunday or Saturday? God, oops. Well, what doesn't matter. Um, I've, I've, I've been really surprised by how well things have gone so far. Effectively, it's just been like, it's just been... This was cake. This was honest, like, French Krispy Kreme cake. It was, like, really nice cake. And it was just took, like, 30 minutes instead of the normal hour of, you know, jabbing you in the arm to get a pick line. Also, they're giving me nicotine patches so I can have crazy dreams whenever I fall asleep. Nicotine patches cause you to have nightmares. It's a fact. It's also really fun when you're in the hospital and you have nothing better to do. Give yourself nightmares. You, it, really what it does is it allows you to remember your dreams. It gives you more acetylcholine, norepinephrine in your brain when you're asleep, when you wouldn't normally have that. And that's what causes memory to be built. So I don't know why I do that whenever I come in and why I've become Southern again, but uh, yeah. So <laughs> that's where I'm at. Um, so kind of in terms of like how I'm doing, Sinuses are still fucked up, obviously. Lungs are doing a lot, like, noticeably better within three days. And that's because IV antibiotics are IV antibiotics. I'm on meropenem. I don't know why I had to say that into the mic. I'm on meropenem and on uh, cefepime. The full cefepime. Not ceftaz or ceftriathra or whatever. There's cefepime and ceftazidime. There's, I, I don't know why, but I'm always on ceftaz. This is not, is the point. I'm on cefepime and tobra. Or not tobra. Fuck. Mycin. I'm on meropenem. Ugh, it's not as effective. It's not as strong, but it's as effective. And also, I have an excuse to not be wearing a shirt. Not like I want to be doing that with my skin infection, the level of that. That's so bad. That's horrible. I hate this so much. I literally hate the acne more than I hate being sick. Um, and the antibiotics don't have that bad a side effect right now. They're actually not terrible. They're almost always like the tobramycin. I'm always on tobramycin, and I'm not now. <clears throat> That's probably why. It's just that they're, the antibiotics, 100% of the time, and this will set in at some point to a full degree, or it'll, it'll, it's already set in. It's just that it'll, it'll, it'll get to its full point, peak potential, uh, in, a, in a couple days. The antibiotic side effects are f-violent. They're f-violent. Okay? They're really, they're, they're fuck. They suck. They're very intense, and like stomach has already gone out the window, but um, I still have like my my knees don't really hurt that bad yet. All of the signs like headache, all the signs that like it's going re like you know I'm really getting hit by the antibiotic or that I may need to slow down on it are are not yet there. So I'm doing good on that. Uh, let's see what else is there to randomly spout off about. Uh, well. I have the best nurses. I am on the same floor that I've been on every time I come in, and I love it. Everybody knows me, and it is great to be here because 
one, Brigham and Women's knows what they're doing. They actually know what they're, like, every single person knows what they're doing. It's great. It's so fucking amazing to see a hospital like that, right? Right? I'm sure somebody can relate to that. Probably everyone. Um, so, yeah. Um, I'm set. I'm here. I'm set up. I have this thing. This is, by the way, a tunneled central line. It goes into your jugular and goes into your heart right there. It's like right there. I'm pointing directly at the end of this giganto tunneled central line. It's really a tunneled catheter, central catheter, which what, that's what a PIC means, P-I-C-C, peripherally inserted central catheter. And so there's no like quick acronym for this. It needs to be like JIC. This is thick. The, the tertiarily, hereditarily inserted central cath, thick. Thick. Um, <laughs> sorry. All right. So there you go. I'm here. This is my room. This is me. And we are going to jump right into playing. Probably, I don't know. Oh, I got Far Cry 5. So we're going to be playing Far Cry 5 for the next duration of that entire game. Um, and other than that, yeah. Trikafta is pushing me along, and I am still alive, and we're in an awesome room, and treatment has begun. So, there you go. All right. I will see you guys in whatever video I think of making. <laughs>